Hello, my name is Maureen Cooper and I'm here to talk to you about the course um, How to Tame Your Inner Critic that I'm putting on with online events starting on the 13th of February next year. And I think you'll agree with me. You must have many clients that talk to you about their critical voice, the voice in their heads that urges them this way and that. And if we're honest, we have one too. <laughs> More or less everybody I know has some kind of inner voice uh, that they have to contend with. So we've chosen a special format for this course. We're going to restrict it to a small group of just 20 people in order to create an intimate, friendly, uh, dynamic environment where each of us can explore and exchange our own uh, battles with our inner critic while um, seeing how we can help our clients better. So the course will be six weeks for 20 people. We'll ask people as far as possible to attend every session, to keep their cameras on, to be up for engaging in uh, breakout rooms. And what will we do? Well, the clues in the subtitle, the subtitle of the course is a six week journey from judgment to compassion. Because don't you find it is all too easy to battle with this inner critic, to set up a, a resistance to it, which only makes it stronger, which only puts us in a, in a sort of this situation with this voice in our heads. So we want to look at how we can understand this voice um, rather than react to it. We want to look at it in the context of self-compassion, realising that uh, we need to be more kind to ourselves, that everybody has a voice like this. It's a fact of common humanity. We're all in the same boat and that we need to pay attention to it. And gradually, uh, my hope is that we'll be able to see that there is there are other ways of relating to the inner critic, of learning to listen to it, of trying to understand what it's saying, and to even glimpse that underneath it all, it cares about what happens to us. So, I would love it if you felt like joining in. Um, I'm looking forward to working on this course. It's a topic close to my heart. So please take care, have a good end of year and hope to see you in February.